So we just got this bow in the mail. Let me show you how to set it up. So in here comes the main part of the bow. It's this piece here. And then move that out of the way so you can see a little bit easier. And we have the other parts here as well. Pull those out of the package. The nice thing is everything's wrapped individually, so it seems like it can be shipped really well without being broken. All right, there's the other side. And then it has a bunch of hardware. There are no instructions included, so you'll just have to kind of figure out how to do it. But hopefully this video will give you a good example. All right, so in the hardware bag, you have the, um, the sort of felt, you have the line, and then you have this Allen wrench. So on the bow itself, yeah, it's not marked on, um, it does have some marks here. So you're gonna use that, or I would use that for the bottom. Oops. Then this is the middle. So um, it's left-handed, yep. Yeah. So this is the rest. Um, so you're gonna have this piece on the bottom here. So the way it's gonna work is you're gonna unscrew this. And if you bought this and you refer back, this is a great way to learn how to assemble it. Unscrew this all the way. Just like that. This piece comes off. Then this has two holes in it. And it's just gonna sit like this into that notch there. And this screw is gonna go back through this, through the hole. Just like that. Screw it in. I would leave a little bit loose because we still have to run the line onto the bow. That's hard to do if it's all super tight. There are other things you could do to help get you to help you get it on, but I'm just kind of do this. Okay. And same thing on the other side. Unscrew this all the way. Oops. It takes a little bit of work. Just get here. It's one of those things that's probably much easier with two people. Someone can hold this, the other person can unscrew it. And same kind of thing. Screw it all the way. It's gonna pop off. And this same thing. So notch goes in the bomb hole and that goes on the top. Then you want the curves facing towards you where you would hold it. I'm gonna tighten this down. Okay, I'm gonna leave a little loose for the moment just to get it all lined up. Nice thing is assembly is pretty straightforward. Okay, so that's basically assembly of that. And here is the line, so you're gonna undo it. And then this is the center where the arrows would go. So you're just gonna make sure that piece sits center, which it does. Let's see if it's the same both ways. It is a little taller that way. So that's the way we're gonna do it because it's the arrow rest there. So you're gonna tighten these down all the way now that you have it on and you're gonna want to look like this. So if you're holding it like this, it's gonna curve away from you just like this as a good example. So now you're going to take the string and you're going to line it up with the bow to kind of see where it should sit. So that looks good. So I'm going to put it on the bottom and I'm just going to slide it up a little bit on there and then I'm going to put it over the top, slide it down just a bit so I get both sides on. So what I find the easiest way to do this is I just slide it back down to the base and then I put my foot on it to bend it. And then I slide the top on. You wanna keep the bottom in the spot it's in. It's the trick and that little notch it's in. So I'm gonna bend it, bend the top. 
So for the final stringing to get in the notch, you need two people because it's, I mean, you have a lot of weight on this line. And so that's how you do it. And then once you're done, you just put your arrow on and you pull back and you're good to go. So there you go. There's a really nice bow that's easy to assemble, just requires two people for the final stringing and you've got a good setup.